Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Hi Yuna, welcome to the vlog. Guys, today is an exciting video because I have my Brooklyn bedding mattress here and I'm replacing it with another Brooklyn bedding mattress. I'm gonna tell you guys that in just a moment. But first, I would like to show you guys my camper. It's Halloween weekend and I wanna show you my Halloween costume. And I am here at Camp Margaritaville and I'm having a great time with Yuna and i've been meaning to vlog all weekend and unfortunately i haven't and i've been meaning to put this mattress in and i've been procrastinating and so now i'm gonna do it for you guys it's now sunday evening ha over half the campground's gone but first i'm gonna take you on a tour of my camper but first i want to show you guys my halloween costume that never happened last night and that is this the party pooper guys I was going to be the prime pooping position this weekend for Halloween, but unfortunately, I didn't know that you needed four AAA batteries, and I didn't open up that Halloween costume until trick-or-treating started, so I was never the prime pooping position for Halloween. But we did, bing, pass out liquefied and Reese's to all the campers, and it was funny because, uh. The campers, all, all the kids, they were like, why is it cold? Because I put my Reese's, Reese's, I put my Reese's in the refrigerator because that's the only way you want to eat Reese's is when they're cold. You don't want warm melted chocolate. So before I tell you guys why I'm replacing my Brooklyn Betty mattress, I want to take you have a tour of the RV. And you know, it's just been you and me this weekend. And you know, look at the floor. You're such a mess, girl. Look, you got my socks everywhere. Her lammy, her sausage. Show us your lammy, you know. You know, show us your lammy. Come on, show us your lammy. There you go. Show everybody your lammy. You love your lammy? Yes. But this is me over the weekend, hanging out in here and look at all this crap. So I've been on a diet and it's more of a lifestyle change diet. That's Eunice food, but I'm switching to these Quest chips. I've been drinking these protein drinks. Um, and the reason why it's all sitting on the counter is because not only did I not have AA batteries, I don't have a trash can or a trash bag. The little things in life. So I've been camping all weekend. I, I wanna show you one thing. I wanna show you the bathroom. Bathroom looks nice. Look at the bottles of water. I've been camping all weekend only with power hookup. I have no sewer dump, I have no fresh water hookup or anything, um, and that is because I am trying to fill up the black tank to do the nose test for liquefied. Our brand of black tank toilet treatment, as you can see, I barely used any of it, um, and the black tank, I actually haven't even tested this yet, is only one third full. So I'm actually not even gonna dump the tanks this trip uh, because I wanna see how full I can get it and to see if any odor. Eventually there will be odor, right? But I wanna see what's that breaking point of odor. But now the reason why I have this awesome Brooklyn bedding mattress and I'm about to swap it out. Actually, you know what? Let me swap out the mattress and then I am telling you why I swapped it out. That was actually a lot easier than expected. All right, so here's our new mattress from Brooklyn Bedding. It's real, you know, you better back, you best back up, baby girl. All right, so as you can see, getting the mattress out of the camper was a little difficult for me. I'm sweating. Um, it's very heavy, very awkward to get out of the camper, but that's not what most mattresses are like. Most mattresses are the cheap flimsy ones from the manufacturer. So they're really easy to get out. Once you have a really nice mattress like Brooklyn Bedding, it is hard to get out of the camper, but 
to set it up, it's very, very easy. So first, I do want to mention RV Mattress, Brooklyn Bedding. Uh, they're made in Arizona. Um, they ship it. They have free shipping nationwide. When you order a mattress, they ship it to your door just like this. So it makes it super easy to bring to your camper. And it makes it so much easier to get it and set it up. Because if I would have had to do what I had to do to get this unit out, to get this mattress out of the camper, as I do to getting it in the camper, honestly, I don't even think I would waste the time or the effort with getting a new mattress. I'd rather sleep on cardboard than try to put this mattress that's already extended out into the camper. So with that said, I'm gonna take this out of the box here and then let's get it into the RV. I mean, look at this. So I'm not gonna lie, dealing with that box was kind of a pain in the butt. I tried to get it in here first and it wasn't working well. With this, this is super easy. It's smaller, it's compact. I'm able to do this. But as you saw, I just flipped it inside and it's really nice. Now I'm just rolling it to the room. All right. Think about what it took to shrink wrap this. There's a hole in it, I can hear it. Like magic. Wow. Just like that. All right, before we get, before we uh, finish up, there is some other things I wanna show you about the mattress, but I wanna tell you, why did I take out my mattress and put in a new mattress? So there's two reasons. One, I did have the signature mattress, which is like their medium mattress. And after the situation happened, I decided to upgrade to the Aurora, which is their best mattress top of the line. And the reason why I decided to do that is because Yuna here had a hard time jumping up on the Aurora when we had the motorhome. So I thought getting the signature mattress she'd have an easier time hopping up on the bed in the travel trailer. But I didn't realize the signature in the Aurora is only a one inch difference. So after I got the signature and Yuna still couldn't hop up on the bed, when the situation happened, I decided, you know, what, let me just go back to the Aurora to get the ultimate best night of sleep. But here's what happened. My unit was in Michigan and me, Will and Jen were filming in Indiana and we were on our way back to Michigan and I needed Will and Jen to help me film this video because I don't know how this video is turning out so far, but it's probably not the best video I've ever made point of view mode, right? So I call up Cosmo and I'm like, Cosmo, oh, we're getting to wick some after hours. And I'm like, Cosmo, set my trailer up outside and have the shop guys put the mattress, just put it outside of the shop, right? Because you know, we, we're on our way to Wixom to install it. Now note, this was four hours out of our way, two hours there, two hours back. 
we get there after hours, like eight o'clock at night, no big deal because we'll be able to install it with the lights on on the inside. We get inside and the awesome shop guys at General RV in Wixom decided they wanted to do me a favor and they installed the mattress themselves. And I can't tell you how much I appreciate the shop guys at General RV of Wixom. It was either the shop guys or the parts guys or somebody. I can't tell you how much I appreciate that. But what they failed to realize is I'm the one that had to take it out of the box and install it so, so I could get this video done. So, you know, shout out to them. And then because of that, I decided that I'm actually going to spend my own money to buy the Aurora. And then the signature mattress, I'm actually going to give to my next door neighbor uh, because they take care of my house while, uh, while I'm on these work trips and they have an RV themselves. So I'm going to bring that to them. You and I, we're going to go for a walk. We're going to show you a little bit of this campground. And then there's a few more things I want to show you about this mattress. So a few reasons why I really love RVmattress.com. One, they make mattresses that are designed for RVs. As you guys know, RVs are unique and different. A queen size bed and a Baystar is a different queen size bed and a Delta. So they make mattresses tailored to RV owners. They make different sizes. They're factories based in Arizona. They have a 100 sleep, 120 night sleep trial guarantee, free shipping, the best customer support in the industry. And it's just a fantastic product. Not only that, when you buy a new RV or even a used RV, the mattresses that they give you are the crummiest mattresses out there. They're super thin, springy, and they're really not good. And that's because they know you're not going to be necessarily sleeping on that mattress. There's companies like RVmattress.com and even other companies that make mattresses that are so much more comfortable and everybody sleeps different. They're soft sleepers, firm sleepers, medium sleepers. I get a medium because that one works best for me. And if you guys don't know which type of sleeper you are, there's a chart on rvmattress.com's website to figure it all out. Yuna, you're a bad girl. My worst fear happened. Little kid left chocolate on the ground and you know went up and ate it. Hopefully she'll be okay. I got most of it out of her mouth. And she's a big girl. She's 77 pounds. You know. That is the worst part about Halloween. Especially if you're a pet owner, you know. I think she'll be okay because it wasn't too much and she's a big girl. But again, if you're, you know, a little two, three pound dog. Yoon, what do you have to say for yourself? What do you think, Yoon? Do you like our new mattress? Yeah, it's pretty good. I do want to let everybody know Brooklyn Bedding doesn't sell just the mattresses. They sell the sheets, which I will be putting on when Andrea gets back. I swear to God, I do not know how to put sheets on. So, pillow and this weighted blanket. Now I have been using this weighted blanket and here's why I really like this y'all. The reason why is because it's very heavy, it's weighted, but there's these little holes and it doesn't seem like much, but those little holes work real well with the air conditioning. So I'm like staying cool, but also staying like warm. I know that's dumb. And then they got this pillow here, which I haven't used yet, but we got it right here. And again, vacuum seal. This is my knife that I got in Switzerland, by the way, my Swiss Army knife from Switzerland. So my uh, natural materials for a uh, healthier sleep. Very cool, guys, something smell. There's something in this pillow. I don't know what it is, it feels good. I'm gonna sleep on it and I'm gonna let you guys know. It says organic cotton. Like it smells like um, like a certain store or something like that. 
like um, like a Michaels. You know what I'm saying? So, guys, that's it. That's the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, big shout out to RVMatches.com, Brooklyn Betting. They are one of our absolute best sponsors on the show. Thank you for hooking it up with the first mattress. Again, I did buy this one with my own money because I was too embarrassed to ask RV Mattress for another mattress after they just sent me one. But if you guys need a new mattress, please use my promo code down below, Matt, for 25% off. You guys know it. I link it down in every YouTube description below. And also, November 11th, I'm doing a meet and greet at General RV in Chicago, Illinois. So make sure you guys join us there and make sure if this video gets a thousand thumbs up, we will give away a mattress this year at the Tampa RV show. So drop a comment down below. Let us know if you like videos like this. Obviously, I just got my new travel trailer. So there's going to be a whole bunch of other neat RV accessories that we're going to have to get. So if you like videos like this, please let us know by commenting down below. And um, and yeah, and hopefully we hit a thousand likes and we will make RVmatches.com give away an awesome mattress at the Tampa RV show this year. Bye, you know.